you would never imagine, but here we are back on track with a new episode of K-Cup, my makeup. This time I'll show you how to apply makeup on deep set eyes if you want to look like yourself. So if you're fed up with all the drag queen makeup tutorials, here's what you can do. First, moisturize your skin. You really need to moisturize it because moisture is foundation to all the great makeup looks. And with Touche Club, you can never go wrong, except if you're allergic to the Empire Light, so these metal crystals that are in it. And with this color correcting green Touche Club, you can turn yourself into a lovely kitty because there's always a bit of a kitty in each, <laughs> in each cow. I just wanted to correct um, her color a bit, not correct, but just neutralize uh, that redness she has on cheeks. That's why I used a bit more yellow toned foundation as well. And it's a very natural thin texture uh, of foundation. If I were a girl, I think it would be easiest for me if um, I would apply eye makeup looking down like this. If I would have deep set eyes, that is because the brush just sticks in place. Do you see how easy it is? It's just put the brush there, rub it in that C motion. I turned the angle of the camera here on the side as well so that you see uh, what I'm doing, just blending it outwards. The more you blend it outwards, the more of a cat eyes uh, you will get. And if you want to look more bubbly, just don't extend that flick in the end. This always lifts the eyebrow here if you're applying white. It sort of makes the space between the eye and the eyebrow, which results in uh, having a lifted look. I wanted to give her a bit of an like autumn colors because this is actually an autumn makeup tutorial. Therefore, I used orange because she has reddish undertone of the skin. Using orange here, uh, will just spice it up, you know. <laughs> it won't look that um, pinkish anymore. It's always makeup is just playing with colors, you know. How, for example, you can change something or make it appear different even though it's not. It's, it's pretty much an illusion. I bought this mascara that actually lasts for ages and I'm quite satisfied with it, especially with the brush. And so for all of you who don't yet uh, know about our blog, go there, www.advisemystyle.com because you have a detailed step-by-step um, -step makeup illustrations for this look. Just go on our, our blog. I'm uh, applying a pencil on the eyebrows. I went all over them before with the foundation, so this actually sticks. Um, and uh, underneath, this is just eight hours sleep in the click, put a bit of a brighter shade under the eyes and uh, you will look like you slept enough. And uh, this is my favorite lipstick actually. This was such a, a hit, like this was incredible. People were buying this 52. Uh, Rouge Pour Couture by Yves Saint Laurent, like crazy. I've seen people buying hundreds of these. I think this was the biggest hype uh, in regards to lipstick ever. And I'm just bronzing her face, just a bit on the nose, on the forehead, where the sun would hit her, on the cheeks slightly. Well, I've like a bit more contour, which you see here. It's actually bronzer, but it looks sort of a, like, a, like a contour, just giving her color. Just play with makeup, who cares, you know, contour, shading, whatever, just have fun. Check out our blog, uh, see the illustrations for this makeup, and I'll see you soon. Ciao, ciao.